And another woman that could take us for money If I wrote you a symphony Just to say how much you mean to me Good morning. I'm always uh I'm always filming in the morning. I'm watching Nick and King. Um this documenting. I done cried two times. Like I don't know what's on me. Anyway. So I'm doing a vlog as you can tell in the title. I'm upside down. As you can tell in the title, I'm doing a vlog. Um I'm gonna do a day in the life of me because I do have a lot of stuff to do today. Um and I'm also doing the Q&A mukbang. I should just do... I should just... Oh. I should just do it um, all together. Hold on, let me clear my camera. Yeah, I'm just going to do a blog slash mukbang Q&A all together because I have a lot of stuff to do. And the Q&A won't last long at all. This is probably not going to last long at all. This is probably going to be like 12 minutes. But anyway, tune in. Gonna go get ready. Okay, y'all, listen. I still look a hot mess, but I'm gonna get hair. Cause look at my hair, it looks a mess. So I'm gonna get hair. I'm getting my hair done tomorrow. Um <laughs> I'm getting my hair done tomorrow. But I'm gonna do my hair for the video. I'm gonna like just look it back. <laughs> and Traffic is really heavy today. Police is out today. And I just don't have time today. And I'm also going to go pick me up something to eat. Because, you know, this is a mukbang video. I don't really know what to eat. I don't eat seafood. I don't eat... I don't even know what people eat during mukbangs, for real. I looked it up last night. And everybody literally eats seafood. A lot of people ate Wingstop. And y'all know, Wingstop, oh my god, it made me hurt so bad. It made me... It made me gag. I can't... I can't eat Wingstop. I wanted some Mexican food, but Mexican food mm, kind of sound good. But I don't know about it. <laughs> I don't know about it. So we'll just see. We'll just see after I get my hair. Got the hair. I had to run outside because it started raining again. And I'm about to go get something to eat. I'm so hungry. I have not ate all day. And that's my problem. I'll be starving myself like, girl, if you don't go get you something to eat. But I just don't know what to eat. Nothing sounds good, like, at all. Mexican food sounds good, but then again, I don't want my stomach to be hurt. <laughs> oh, I don't want my stomach to be hurting. I'm probably just about to call me. I'm about to just call me in order for Mexican food. Some shrimp sounds so good. Some shrimp and rice. I actually might call me. I actually might call it in. I think that's probably where I got it from. Cause I got it from off of the off of that one by the mall. Okay y'all, I made it back home. I got the hair. I got the food. Mm, 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 mm. Got the food. <laughs> uh, I got Mexican food because I don't nothing sounded good. But I got Mexican food. Okay. It's so good. And I had to get an extra. I had to get an extra side of rice. Because they don't give you. No. They don't give you no rice. They don't give you enough at all. Like at all. Um, I've been waiting forever to eat this. Oh my god. Oh. Let me see. They don't really give you enough at all. But he gave me pork and some chips and then I got a body armor because I've been so addicted to body armors. I've been so addicted to body armors, but let's get into the video. So I asked y'all to ask me questions and of course y'all asked me too many questions. No, not too many. It's a lot. <laughs> but um about to get into these questions some of these questions i gotta re reword because i was just rushing i think i'll be half sleep okay i was going to make sure y'all see my food but you know what <laughs> okay Let me get my okay so the first question is 
what is the worst day experience you've ever had? If you know me, you know that I have only dated one person before. I wouldn't say he was the worst person. I've talked to people. I've talked to boys definitely. I wouldn't say that I've had a bad dating experience. Um, maybe a little embarrassing, but not bad. Like, I'm... He's done things that just em makes me embarrassed to be with him, you know? Mm, how many kids do you want? <laughs> y'all, y'all on this question. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. Probably two, a boy and a girl. No. Mm -hmm. If I have a girl, no, I don't know, girl. If I have a girl, I'm done. I'm gonna get ruined because I already know she's gonna have my attitude. It's gonna be just like, and that's karma. That's karma because I do it to my mom all the time. We are just alike. And I be feeling bad. I feel bad all the time. Next question is, what do you look for in a man? <laughs> Loyalty. Personality. A snake. If you know, you know. Mm. He gotta be funny. I can't out funny you because I'm funny. So if we messing around and I'm funny and you're not, that's boring. Boo. Tomato, tomato, tomato. Um, what's your life goals? My life goal is to okay, I got it all planned out. No, not really. But I wanna be um a YouTuber of course. I wanna do makeup, all that shit I wanna live in a big house with floor to ceiling windows. With a city view, um, I'm manifesting it. A white Jeep with a husband, two kids. They won't be juniors because I don't even play like that. Um, I just want to be happy. Yeah, we're going to be so happy. Anyway, what's your favorite color? That is so basic. My favorite color is orange. I actually like I actually like all the colors. Like I don't have a favorite color, but if I had to pick if I had to pick one, it would be orange. Definitely be orange. Dang, this shrimp is big. Um What's your favorite food? Mexican. <laughs> and buffalo chicken dip. I love buffalo chicken dip, but mm, 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 mm. buffalo chicken dip is so good. Mm. How long have you been doing makeup? Mm. Dang, let me, let me finish the one. <laughs> okay, so I started doing makeup when I was like in eighth grade, and I just started off with eyebrows, like. One of my best friends did it. Well, she's not a best friend anymore. No, ex best friend. She did makeup. She did her eyebrows and everything. And I was like, oh my gosh, I want to do that. Like, eyebrows are just so cool. Back then, I wanted to do with the little animal doctor. I forgot what it's called. Not the vet, not the veterinarian, but the ones that's in the water. I forgot. But I wanted to be a little doctor to them. I want to do all that. I was, I was looking at schools and everything. I was in eighth grade. I was looking at schools and everything to go to for that. Little do I know, girl. You just want to do makeup, girl. But anyway, um, so yeah, I did makeup, or I did makeup when I was in eighth grade, but I just started off with eyebrows. I started getting into makeup, makeup, like the, um, like cut crease and all that stuff. I started getting into that when I was a freshman, I think. I'm going to show y'all the very, very first makeup look I ever did. Because <laughs> that's embarrassing. Why would you do that? But I got progressively better. Um, I still practice on myself a lot. I don't really do a lot of people's. But I don't do a lot of people's because a lot of people don't come to me. They always go to somebody else. Or or they just change their mind. I don't know. Um, what's, your, what's something that humbled you? 
Mm. It wasn't something, it was somebody. <laughs> and mm -mm. I've always been, I don't know, looking in the mirror, it humbles me every day. But, but at the end of the day, I'm still a bad, I'm still a bad itch. So I'm never going. Mm. This is just so good, like. Mm. If you could take back one thing that you did, what would it be? I'm losing my virginity. That's another story time for another day. But I would definitely, I would definitely bring that back. It's not the losing my virginity part. It's who I lost it to. Um, I would definitely take that back if I could. Because, you know, I don't even play like that. But it's okay. It's okay. We we always gonna bounce back. We always gonna bounce back. Um, what makes you keep doing makeup without getting bored or sick of it? Honestly, I I just I just I do it every day, and then it's just something that's just natural to me. Like do your makeup, and I don't get tired of it because you can do so much with it. Like my mind is so creative you can do so much with makeup like you can do sfx looks which is like special effects uh you can do like prom looks you can do like you can just do so much with it it's just so much more you can do and a lot of people was like oh like that's boring like it gets old but if you really have a passion for it and if you really love it then it won't get boring it won't get tiring and you know I just don't. I just have so many ideas, but I just don't have enough enough time. Mm. What's a dream? What's a dream state you would like to move to? Texas. Mm -mm -mm. It's hot in Texas, but I want to go. I want to go so bad. And I don't know why, because I hate the heat. I would rather be cold. I don't even play like that. But this is such a beautiful city. And everybody who goes to Texas, like everybody wants to go to Texas. And I've always wanted to go there since I was like in sixth grade. If you could go back to high school. The next question is if you could go back to high school, would you? Yes. I miss high school. Only because I used to talk to everybody. Everybody knew me. Everybody loved me. Um, I I was what you call friendly. <laughs> yes, I was friends with everybody. And there was no no beef, no drama, no nothing. And I miss it. I miss it because now I don't talk to nobody. Um, I have a couple friends, but I don't talk to nobody for real. Next question is, how long do you like your nails? Extra, 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 extra long. I'll insert a few clips of my nails because I love my nails long. The only reason they're not done now is because the job that I had, the job that I had, they didn't, um, they didn't like long nails or whatever, and they didn't like hair touching your back. But you know, I had to give me some hair because I ain't play like that my hair looks a mess like I don't know what to do with it like I'll be running out of stuff to do with it so if y'all have some suggestions just hit me with the hairstyles and the um makeup looks just hit me with suggestions I'm always open to suggestions I love when people give me suggestions I love um criticism I like that because at the end of the day that's only making me better mmm how do you get so many followers on TikTok? Listen. TikTok is a funny place. It's so easy to get famous. And not even famous. It's so easy to go viral because everybody looks for everybody looks for something to complain about. Everybody looks for something to nitpick about. And one thing about them, they're gonna comment, they're gonna share it, they're gonna make fun of you. But at the end of the day, that's money in your pockets. And that's my favorite part about it.
Mm, that's all the questions. There was a lot more, but I don't want to make this video that long. And my food is still, ooh, almost dropped it. I still got so much food. I asked for extra case, so they did not even put it in here. Like, I need to check the bag before I leave because why do I always, I always do that. Always. And sometimes it's always messed up. But, thank you all for watching. And my edges is messed up. Thank you all for watching. I'm going to see y'all in my next video. I don't know when that's going to be, but I'm going to continue to make videos just because these are actually kind of, these are actually kind of fun. But anyway, hope you enjoy.